Wrapping things up, Miss Kat Krapel with another fabulous craft. This one, we, we actually got the sewing machine out. Yes. Thought it was going to be difficult. It is not. I actually feel like I can do it, which is it's a big deal. Yep. So if I can, they can. So we turned them inside out. Yes. Okay, so we're at that point. And all I did here was pin around, and then you're going to take the iron and press. These pins are, are, are heat resistant, so that's good. You don't want to melt a thing on your ironing board. Oh. But before we did that, we, we turned it, flipped it inside out, and then you just take, this is a chopstick or whatever, <laughs> and you're just going to kind of poke out those, those corners, points. Yeah. yeah, so that you get that point that you see. Uh, and that's all you're going to do. Then you're just going to take, you're going to have the opening, of course, but when you go to do your stitching around the edge, your trim, it's going to close that up. And again, you're going to be ironing that as well. So you're just going to kind of see when you push it in this way, you mm -hmm. can see it forming and you see the darts that we made earlier yeah. that we snipped. Which is all of those are in there. And again, reversible, flip it inside out, use it on either side, um, you know. It's great for the kids too, because yep. you know some may be a little younger or right. at home with the right. babysitter or you know right. supervising each other. This is a great you know in yep. and out of the microwave. You can even grab here. And you, you can make them smaller too for the little hands if you wanted to, um, or larger for whatever that need might be. <laughs> but also, I think it would be a great idea if you're out of school, preteen, teenager, you want to craft. Maybe sell these on Etsy. They Ooh. sell for. I think some up to ten dollars, if the I'm not mistaken. The concept is yeah. fabulous. And the fabric, I did want to mention that earlier. I just picked up fabric squares from uh, Joanne. Is that what you did? You can. I had a lot of scraps too. A lot of these were scraps from previous shows. But the, squ the squares ones. are a dollar fifty, and you get, I think it's a half a yard, if I'm not mistaken. And it's a lot. You could probably make, I don't know, four or five of these. The batting is expensive, but you could also use a washcloth if you wanted to. Uh, be careful because the threads will get caught in the machine. But again, I didn't go edge to edge. I just went right on the, on the about an inch wow, inside. Wow, that is so true. I would so, never think of that. But a great craft if they want to have a, uh, you know, raise some money over the, uh, the summer. Absolutely. Sure, keeps them busy. Great gifts, as yeah. we can see here. Can we get yeah. a close-up, Tyler? How this cute is this? Yeah. Essentially, Kat made this for Al because if you didn't know, he is out this week. He's getting that knee taken care of, so that will be perfect. Yep. A little get well you Just gift. put a couple in. I did a small, large. I did the bowl and a bo uh, can of soup. Yes. You know, get well soon card that with eyeballs so on it. So, yes. Eyeballs, of course. <laughs> yes. Always, yeah. So, so cute, Kat. We yep. appreciate you so much. This is a great one. And guys, uh, if you are just tuning in thinking, oh, no, I missed it. You didn't. We're going to have all of this on our website for you so you can follow along. How about it? Uh, can't wait to see what we get in next time. We'll see Miss Cat in two weeks. But for now, we're going to go to break. When we return, we'll get a check of the weather.